Let us start by appreciating all of you, gentlemen of the press. I know you have been here since morning with us. We thank you for your presence and look forward to adequate coverage of this meeting. This is a communique issued at the conclusion of the meeting of the governors of Southern Nigeria in the government house, Asaba, Delta State, today, Tuesday, 11 May 2021. At its meeting held today, the Southern Governors Forum review the situation in the nation generally and focus on the current security situation, agitation and restructuring, prospect for interstate collaboration and partnership, as well as on the incidence of COVID-19 pandemic. Rising from the meeting, the forum agreed as follows. The forum affirmed that the peoples of southern Nigeria remain committed to the unity of Nigeria on the basis of justice, fairness, equity, and oneness, and peaceful coexistence between and among its people with a focus on the attainment of shared goals for economic development and prosperity. Two, the form observed that the caution of armed herders, criminals and bandits in the southern part of the country has presented a severe security challenge such that citizens are not able to live their normal lives, including pursuing various productive activities, leading to a threat to food supply and general security. Consequently, the meeting resolved that open grazing of cattle be banned across southern Nigeria. Three. The meeting noted that development and population growth has put pressure on available land and increased the prospect of conflict between migrant herders and local population in the south. Given this scenario, it becomes imperative to enforce the ban on open grazing in the south, including cattle movement to south by foot. The meeting recommended that the federal government should support willing states to develop alternative and modern livestock management system. Five, the meeting agreed that the progress of the nation requires that urgent and bold step be taken to restructure the Nigerian Federation, leading to the evolution of state police, review of revenue formula 
in favor of subnationals and creation of other institutions which legitimately advance a commitment to and practice of true federalism. The meeting recommended that in view of the widespread agitation among our various peoples for greater inclusiveness in existing governance arrangement, the federal government should convoke a national dialogue as a matter of urgency. The meeting recommended that in defense of the sensitiveness or in deference, sorry, in deference to the sensitiveness of our various peoples, there is need to review appointment into federal government agencies, including security agency, to reflect federal character as Nigeria's overall population is heterogeneous. Eight, the meeting resolved to foster cooperation among southern states. Nine, the meeting expressed concern on the continued gridlock on those show the Apapa Express Way and the chokehold it has exerted on the nation economy, being the sole outlet from Apapa Wharf. The meeting therefore recommended the activation and establishment of ports in other states of the Federation to create new jobs and promote socio-economic activities in the country. The meeting expressed concern on the economic implication of another lockdown on the country and therefore suggested greater coordination and cooperation between federal and state government in involving strategies for dealing with the COVID-19 pandemic. The meeting expressed grave concern on the security challenge currently plaguing the nation and strongly urged Mr. President that Mr. President should address Nigerians on the challenges of insecurity and restore the confidence of our people. And lastly, the meeting expressed gratitude to our host, Governor Ifai Okowa, for his generosity and hospitality. Thank you. You must sign because we all agreed. Okay, can we all come back again because television are here now? Can we all the governors come here now? Can we go from there? From there, go from there.
Thank you. How was the meeting today? I think you just solidified, uh, solidified the cooperation between um, governors of the states in southern Nigeria. Um, and we looked across the range of issues affecting us, uh, ranging from security to regional cooperation to the economy, and um, took certain decisions on how to address these issues. Uh, we believe that Nigeria is one indissoluble an entity that must remain united. However, that unity must be premised on social justice, on fairness, and equity. Wow, thank you very much.